Welcome to my channel, Planning with Maserati. I'm going to be doing a 40-day devotional scripture writing plan for Lent. It is going to be um, day 8, Ephesians 5, 2, but the date is not the same. I will explain that when I get inside the book. So before I begin, welcome, please subscribe, hit that post notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. Please give a big thumbs up, leave a comment, and share the video. That would be greatly appreciated. So with that being said, um, I am a quite, uh, pretty much late on my videos, which is February 20th, and we are on, I believe, February 26th, if I'm not mistaken. And reason being, I was in the hospital, um, diagnosed with a stroke. I had a major stroke. It affected my face um, as far as, um, sorry, I'm just writing. It affected my right side. Okay, so I couldn't move my eye. I couldn't move um, my hands. Now I can open them. They were shut closed. And I'll do a whole video of that later. Um, I'm just going to go into this. But I just wanted to let you know that we are a little behind. And I do apologize. But that is what happened. And yeah. So we pray. We read. Write. Pray and reflect. Soap study scripture. Observation. Application and prayer. Um, this one started February 14th, ended March 8th, 28th, Let's see, oh, I'm just so over this, what happened, okay, sorry, I'm just hitting the camera, like usual, that's the usual thing I do, so Ephesians 5, 2, and Ephesians 5 and 2, and walk in the way of love, just as Christ loved us, gave him and gave himself up for us as a frag, fragrant offering and sacrifice to God. Let's say it again. And walk in the way of love, just as Christ loved us and gave himself up for us as a fragrant offering and sacrifice to God. So how has everybody been doing? How's your scripture writing going? And I have not been doing the devotionals, which is terrible because I've been in the hospital. Um, I got released not yesterday. I think it was the day before. So yeah, I just finally, oh, another thing it did was it took my speech. So I am just getting that back now. They cannot explain what is going on with me. Like right now I feel dizzy and the room is spinning. But they cannot explain what is going on what is happening or anything else they did an mri they did a ct scan um they found white matters in my brain uh they found my uh <clears throat> sorry they found my um you like your main artery in your neck i don't know they found uh that being with um calcified I don't even know where I'm reading. Jesus Christ loved us and gave himself up. Okay. See, I'm just so not here today. But yeah, I'm glad I got my hand back. So yeah, they don't understand what's going on. 
how this happened, but this is my fourth stroke. The first three were just mild. Like, the first one was not bad at all. It didn't take anything. It was just a numbness in the face. And then that was it for that one. So they called it a stroke. And then the second one was the same thing. Numbness in the face. Uh, tingly down the arm. It was like having my hand numb. They called that one a stroke. The third one took my face and um, something with my eye. So I went to the eye doctor for that. But this one took everything. Oh my god. So I have numbness all on my face. And not just on the right side. And uh, my voice sounds different than what it normally is. So... I'm hoping that comes back. So, I'm trying not to do too many videos because they sound weird. I know I have to come back and do my lens and catch up with that. Which I feel so bad because I always want to get scripture writing done with you guys, and it's just it's one thing after another. Zephaniah. So, 317 is the next day. So I'm hoping it comes back. Uh, I'm probably spelling this wrong. Sorry, I keep flipping it on you. So if you don't have this list and you want to copy it now, here's a great time to do it. And so thank you for watching. I hope you like this video and please give it a big thumbs up. Please say a prayer for me. That would be greatly appreciated. And I will talk to you in the next video. Have a good one. Bye-bye.